Hello guys, today I will read for you Fancy Nancy and the Boy from Paris. I almost always get to school early, but on Monday I am tardy. That's a fancy word for late. I come in and see a new kid. He is standing next to Miss Class. Uh, Robert comes from Paris, Miss Glass is telling everyone. He just moved here. Paris. Paris is a city in France. It is gorgeous. That's a fancy word for beautiful. Bonjour, I say in the book nook in French. That means hello. I am Nancy. I never met anybody from Paris before. I speak slowly so he will understand. It's really nice there, Robert says. I miss it. He has a book on cowboys. He probably wants to learn all about this country. I want to go there someday. I show him my book. It's about a dog in Paris. Do you like the United States? Yes, says Robert. Don't you? Yes, I do, I say. I've lived here, I've lived here all my life. Then Miss Class puts a finger to her mouth. Uh, this is not talking time, she says. This is reading time. On Tuesday, I sit next to Robert at lunch. Have you ever been to the Eiffel Tower? I ask him. Robert nods and swallows. Lots of times, our house was near it. I tell Robert, I know about the Eiffel Tower. There's a poster of it in my room. I know lots about Paris. I share some of my lunch. These are donuts holes, I say. Robert gives me a funny look. I know that. I have eaten donut holes before. That night, I tell my mom and dad about Robert. He is very nice. He already speaks English. I want to be his friend. How do you say friend in French? Uh, the word is ami, my mom says. You say it like this, a me. I love French. Everything sounds so fancy. Why don't you ask him over to play, my dad says. So the next day I do. We can play soccer. Did you play soccer in Paris? Sure, all the time, Robert says. I am a good kicker. I can come on Friday. On Tuesday... It is show and share. Robert brings in a toy horse. It's brown and white. My grandpa has a horse like this. Then Robert passes around the photo. I miss her a lot. Her name is Belle. In French, that means beautiful. Belle, I say to myself. Now I know another French word. On Friday, mom is at work. Mrs. Divine picks up. From the, picks us up from school. Mrs. Divine lives next door. I tell Robert. Robert is from Paris, I tell Mrs. Divine. At home, we make a tent in the yard. We pretend bears are outside. We pretend to be terrified. That's a fancy word for scared. Then we play soccer. We let my little sister play too. Robert is a great kicker. My dog runs around the yard. That's Frenchy, I tell Robert. She's not really French, but you will like her anyway. We go inside and I show Robert my room. See, there's the Eiffel Tower, I said. Yes, says Robert, but that one does not have a cowboy hat on it. That Eiffel Tower is in Paris, France. It is taller and is more famous. But we have an Eiffel Tower too. Our Eiffel Tower has a cowboy hat on the top. Wait a minute. I am very perplexed. That's a fancy word for mixed up. But you're from Paris, France, I say. Aren't you? No, I am from Texas. Paris, Texas, Robert says. Miss Glass told everybody that the first day. Robert shows me Paris, Texas on my globe. Oh, I guess I missed that part. And I feel a little silly, but not for long. 
After all, I have a new ami, even if he isn't French. That's it. I hope you like it. Bye!